Frankie Darrow was an American actor and later in his career as stuntman. He began his career as a child actor in silent films, progressed to lead roles and co-starring roles in adventure, western, dramatic, and comedy films, and later became a character actor and voiceover artist. He is known for his role as Lampwick, the unlucky boy turned into a donkey in Walt Disney's second animated feature, Pinocchio, which was originally released in February 1940. Early Life Frankie Darrow was born on Saturday, December 22, 1917 in Chicago, Illinois as Frank Johnson, Jr. His parents, Frank Johnson, Sr., and his wife Ada were known as the Flying Johnsons. A flying circus act with the Sells Floto Circus, it was a profession that his father attempted to train him in, and he cured Frankie's fear of heights by having him walk on a length of wire, and then gradually raised the height of it until his son had mastered the trick. In 1922, while the circus was in California, his parents divorced, and their circus act ended with their marriage. The growing film industry, however, found a use for a small child who could do his own stunts and the young Johnson, renamed Frankie Darrow, appeared in his first film at the age of six. Acting career As a child actor, he appeared in many silent adventure, western, and serial pictures of the 1920s, becoming a very prolific actor as an adolescent. His convincing delivery of dialogue and his obvious comfort before the cameras kept him steadily employed. His most important role during the 1930s was the lead actor in Wild Boys of the Road. Director William Wellman's indictment of aimless teens vagabonding across America during the Depression, he appeared in Mervyn Leroy's Three on the Match in 1932, and was the principal character in the James Cagney feature The Mayor of Hell. Darrow remained popular in serials, and co-starred with Gene Autry in Autry's first starring role in the serial, The Phantom Empire. Darrow's name grew in stature but he himself didn't. He stood only 5 feet, 3 inches, limiting his potential as a leading man. His wiry, athletic frame and relatively short stature often typecast him as jockeys. Darrow played crooked riders in Charlie Chan at the race track and A Day at the races. In 1938 Darrow joined Monogram Pictures to star in a series of action melodramas. Darrow's flair for comedy gradually increased the laugh content in these films, and by 1940 Manton Morland was hired to play his sidekick. The Frankie Darrow series was so successful that Monogram used it as a haven for performers whose own series had been discontinued. Jackie Moran, Marcia May Jones, and Key Luke joined Darrow and Morland in 1940, and Gail Storm would be added in 1941. Darrow may be most familiar to modern audiences as the voice of the unlucky Lampwick in Disney's Pinocchio. Darrow served in the U.S. Navy Hospital Corps during World War II where he contracted malaria. Upon his return to civilian life, Monogram welcomed him back and cast the perennially youthful Darrow in its teenagers, campus comedies. When that series ended, the studio gave Darrow four featured roles in its popular Bowery Boys comedies. He was an accomplished athlete and performed various stunts for other actors in various FLMS. Because of his size and fitness, he was cast in his most famous but anonymous big screen role. Darrow was the actor, operator inside the now iconic seven foot tall Robbie the Robot walking screen prop that debuted in the classic MGM science fiction film Forbidden Planet. Later life Later in his life Darrow appeared on television in The Red Skelton Show, Bat Masterson, Have Gun Will Travel, The Untouchables, Alfred Hitchcock Presents, and Batman. He also did voiceover work for various projects. His recurring malaria symptoms caused him to increase his alcohol intake for pain management, and this affected his career. As film and TV roles became fewer, Darrow opened his own tavern called Try Later, with ex-Hollywood agent Lee Carroll on Santa Monica Boulevard. This proved unwise, given Darrow's heavy drinking. 
By the mid-1950s he had become too risky for producers to hire steadily, although he did continue to play small parts well into the 1960s. Death While visiting his friends in Huntington Beach, California, Darrow died of a heart attack on Christmas Day, 1976, three days after his 59th birthday. His remains were cremated and his ashes scattered into the Pacific Ocean. Partial Filmography Fugitive Lovers as Lester, the town drunk. Batman Episodes 9 and 10 as Newsman. Operation Petticoat as Pharmacist's Mate Third Class Dooley, USN. The Untouchables 2 Episodes as News Vendor. Forbidden Planet as Robbie the Robot. The Red Skelton Show as The Little Old Lady. Heart of Virginia as Jimmy Easter. Troublemakers as Feathers. Angels Alley as Jimmy. Chick Carter, Detective as Thug, Junior Prom as Roy Dunn, Junior G Men of the Air as Jack, Let's Go Collegiate as Frankie Monaghan, The Gang's All Here as Frankie, You're Out of Luck as Frankie O'Reilly, Up in the Air as Frankie Ryan, Laughing at Danger as Frankie Kelly, On the Spot as Frankie Kelly, Pinocchio as the voice of Lampwick, Chasing Trouble as Frankie, Cupid, O'Brien, Irish Luck as Buzzy O'Brien, Boys Reformatory as Tommy Ryan, Juvenile Court, Saratoga as Dixie Gordon, A Day at the Races as Morgan's Jockey, Charlie Chan at the Racetrack as Tip, Collins, Jockey, Valley of Wanted Men 1935 as Slivers Sanderson, The Payoff, The Phantom Empire as Frankie Baxter, Red Hot Tires, Burn, Emmett Barnes as Bobby Riley, No Greater Glory as Ferry A.T.'s, Little Men, The Merry Frinks, The Wolf Dog as Frank Courtney, Wild Boys of the Road as Edward, Eddie, Smith, Tugboat Annie, The Mayor of Hell as James, Jimmy, Smith, The Devil Horse as The Wild Boy, The Mad Genius as The Young Feder Ivanoff, The Lightning Warrior as Jimmy Carter, The Vanishing Legion as Jimmy Williams, the public enemy is the young Matt Doyle, way back home as Robbie, Blaze O'Glory as John Williams, the circus kid as Buddy, little Mickey Grogan as Mickey Grogan, the cowboy cop as Frankie, her husband's secret, roaring rails as little Bill, the signal tower as Sonny Taylor, half a dollar Bill as half a dollar Bill, the judgment of the storm as Heath Twin,